Welcome back to Keeper RL, where we are starting a new series here. We're going to still do it in classic mode. This time we're going to do a female wizard, and the game suggested Patrice, which of course makes me think of Clarice. So we're going to go for Clarice so that I can make jokes about fava beans and Chiantis. Let's get going. And maybe putting lotion on its skin. The world name is Mist. Hey, that's a nice name. So we are... We've got some Dark Elves, which are an ally. Wow, there's not very much on this map. What is this, a cottage? Okay, let's uh, let's do this. Sure, let's try this one. I don't know. And do we want to start in Grassland? I don't really know. Let's just do it. Uh, with the beginning of this series, I am going to try to publish three times a week, which will give folks time to comment. Now that I know that people are actually watching, give, give them time to comment and make suggestions. And I, I was really appreciative of all the support people gave me before. Let's dig out, whoops, let's dig out these trees. I guess dig is a relative term. And actually, let's, uh, well, they can do that while they do that. Let's take control of Clarice and just look around a little. Oh, and we have two question marks on our map, a little bit of stone. Looks like we're just gonna dig into here. This seems like a nice place and then we can come. Yeah, that's, but let's, let's, let's move around a little. Okay, just scope this out. Yeah, this all looks fine. Okay, let's uh, exit control mode. And we're going to go up here. And we'll give them a place to store all this stuff. Storage. I will, I promise, I will learn the hotkeys for more than just dig. <laughs> uh, so let's plan out our base a little bit. And last time I, I, I put our base on the first level below ground. And... That was not something I normally do, but I actually liked the way it worked, so when we were raided, we could get up here quickly. Usually I like to put put it down further so that we can be more protected, but uh, like, like you think of Dwarf Fortress, but I actually think it worked out quite well. So we're going to make spaces for boulder traps. I don't know how much space you need for a boulder trap, but... Um, Obviously, you need a minimum of one. So we'll get this in here. We can always have other stuff in these things. Otherwise, it'll just be pretty. Okay, and then the edge of the map is like uh, right there. So in fact, let's mark the edge of the map. Yeah. Whoop, it won't even let me dig there. Ah, okay. Okay, edge of the map is right there. So now we know that. In fact, why don't we mark it as a zone, we'll do guard area. Nope, can't do it. Okay, very good. So now then we're going to do a, I think we'll do five by five. Let's try a five by five kind of welcome area. That's a six. Okay, let's do six by six welcome area for all of our guests, so to speak. Hey, imps, do your business. We grabbed 151 wood. I'm not even going to look at the immigrants because um, we can't collect them for a little while. Let's pick up the pace. And we are going to go down a level. Oh, no, we can't. No, I, I can't go down at all until I've dug it out. Okay, but we can tell them put in gates. So we're going to have gates here. And torches. I know the hockey for torches well. It's a C. Decorate our place nicely. Okay. And yeah, so we can expand these out and put in boulder traps and things like that. Maybe spider webs like I did last time. But this time I'm intent on getting an insane artificer, and I now, thanks to uh, Taro Opress and Jonathan Woz Woznoski, um, I now have a much better idea of how I can manage my colony. And, my, and the insane minions, that'll make a big difference. Okay, let's get stairs down. Oops, that's an upstairs. We don't want to do that. We're going to build down again, even though obviously we could build up. I'm just a traditionalist that way, I guess.
Oh, let's put some torches inside because I like the way that looks. Whoops. There we go. And there we go. We're getting a lot of juicy ones that we can't pick up. Damage while riding a steed. Hates all elves. I guess that's not that huge a benefit. The other thing is I'm going to try to make these episodes absolutely no longer than an hour. My objective is actually half an hour. And what I had been doing before was was recording. And sometimes if it would go too long, I would just split it into multiple episodes. But now I'm just going to try to do one episode at a time so that everybody can give me feedback. Or anybody who wants to can give me feedback. A little more collaboration. Let's just continue with this uh, six by six thing. If we go up a level, yeah, so we're gonna, right, we'll put stairs here. Yeah, okay, imps, get your butts down here. Thank you, let's speed up the, the action here. In fact, I know I'm gonna want gates here too. I mean, we're ultimately gonna want it. Oops, no, 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 no. There we go, wooden gate. We're gonna want gates here. I'm a big fan of the gates, I just think they, they look nicer. Okay, now that we've done this, let's see what's on this level. Just a little stone. That's fine. We can grab stuff from down below. Look at all these artificers. But why don't we plan out... Why don't we plan out the whole base? Ah! Oh, we're right on the edge. I forgot we're right on the edge. That's okay. That'll be fine. So, and you can hear water dripping. Okay, so we're going to go on to slow for a minute. In fact, we're not even going to go on to slow. We're going to pause. And we're going to plan out our base. So we know that the edge of the map is like right over here. So we're going to work this way. You know, right from the get-go, we're going to make this, we're going to zone this leisure. Uh, zones. So I don't forget. And then this way, our guys are waiting here, hanging out. And we can put... Well, it's, it's early to do it, but we're going to put uh, all the stuff we need to make them happy in there. But let's go down a level. And we're gonna dig out, let's see, how do we wanna do this? We wanna have a big long corridor, whoops. We want a big long corridor. And then off of that corridor, well, we know we're gonna want this. Let's see here, let's put on torches here. We know we're gonna want this. So I guess I could have my, him digging a little bit. So big long corridor here. We want bedrooms. We want work workshops. Actually, maybe we go down a level for workshops and just the living spaces are here. Let's do that this time. That'll be nice. So let's put one more downstairs. We got the pace more. And more. Okay, let's go down. See what we've got here. No question marks on this level, which is what we like to see. We've got the wood mushrooms and some stone, which is perfect. So let's go back to normal speed. We're gonna dig. We'll do, continue with the six by six business. There we go, and we're gonna shove it this way, so we can put the next set of stairs towards the, I guess, the west. That would be. I'm not sure. Okay, you guys get down here. So we're gonna do this level. Will be living area. This level will be working and storage area. Let's zoom in a little. Okay, we can pick up the pace again. Uh, and I guess I can actually be planning out all this time. I usually wait for them to finish. I don't really know why I do that. So let's do living area here. So I liked the five by fives, even though they don't need to be. I like that. It just it just had a nice appearance to me. So let's do, and 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 then when when they get all uppity and snobbish and they need better rooms, then we're just very very well prepared. And what I'll do is I'll actually lay it all out in this plan. Oh, we got something here. You know what we're gonna do is we're gonna dig this out and see what we run into there. But what I was what I was saying was, this way we can drop. Uh, we can open up these rooms whenever we want so we don't have to have our imps dig them immediately we'll just open a, a, a entrance to them when we're ready to have them dug out okay 
and we'll find out what's there in a second. Let's go down a level. Uh, for those of you who are new, up and down, you can go up and down with comma and period or uh, less than and greater than. Okay, we've got water on this level. And remember the edge of the map is right here, so this may actually not work out great. But we should have room down here. I tend to like to go left, right, or horizontal. I don't really know why, but I do. <laughs> so this makes my brain hurt, but uh, you know, sometimes you just gotta do, uh, sometimes you just gotta do what's uncomfortable. We have space down here. We do have all this space though. Mm. No, we're gonna we're gonna do a little exploration. Let's do some planning. Ah, I did it again. I keep using the wasty keys. Oh yeah, dig this out. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe this is this river. Actually, no, we don't. We're not even gonna bother. Dig, undo this. No, sorry, imp. Sorry. We're gonna go up. Oh, you know what? I don't even like this level. We're going down another level. Yeah, go. All right. And what did we find over here? Oh, okay. Okay, so this is a wide open space, but there were no question marks, right? No question marks. So I think we're okay to put in some rooms. And we'll just use this for something else. So let's go down and okay now we can go down another level okay there's a question mark on here and this is some iron and some stone and some gold so i'm gonna guess there's like dwarves or something here so we're not gonna take that risk i'm gonna be less of a a scary cat and just go ahead and expand here we'll let it hit the water we can build bridges over it and we're going to actually expand down here. We can use the stone anyway. And we'll see what we can put in. We know we're close to the bottom of the map over here too, but that's okay. And we'll actually expand this all the way down. Oops, I really actually don't like the zoom out. So I'm going to zoom back in here. So we'll get that wood and that stone. We'll build various things here. Uh, right now, what we'll do is we will put our storage, we're going to do one, just to kind of be cheesy, we're going to do one point of equipment and one point of storage, normal storage here. We're going to go up to the top level and uh, kill this storage. Oops. Okay, and then we're going to tell our imps to go grab these items oh it doesn't really matter we have yeah no right okay this is our leisure space we're gonna go down here might as well open up some of these rooms oh no that's not what i meant to do there we go we'll do four rooms to begin with gonna go down another level you folks are digging this out okay so we need to what is that that looks funny Anyway, we can bridge this. Hopefully we're not going to see a crack in. Otherwise, it's going to be a very short playthrough. Structure. Uh, isn't bridge here? Yes, wooden bridge. Wooden bridge, wooden bridge, wooden bridge. Wooden bridge. Okay, let's see what our imps do there. Yeah, we're not going to dig this out just yet. So obviously this is just cheese because we can you can store as much as you want on a single tile. But I, I like to actually have dedicated storage rooms and, and stuff. I just think it makes it look nicer. Um, so we need a library and a training room and a crafting area and obviously the storage to support that. So why don't we do, uh, I don't know, five by five for those two. Why not? Let's do five by five. Yeah, we can keep that up. This one we're gonna... Oh, and then we'll connect them. Yeah, 
these we want wide or open so that people can move in and out as much as they want. So we're going to call this... Oh, is this... Oh, no, no, no. Oh, yeah, this is a door. Um, I have to think about what I want to do with this. I guess because we can have it wide open. I can put a wall here if I want. Let's, uh, yeah, one, two, three. And then we're going to do five by five again. Yeah, that'll, that'll be fine. That's going to work out quite nicely. Uh, let's go up and see how things are going up here. Okay, we've got our bedrooms here. We'll put some nice doors on them. Ah! And of course we need torches. I'm just gonna tell you the torch key is C because it's one of like the two <laughs> the two hot keys I know. And I, I like to decorate it like it like I imagine that these folks are all living here for real. Okay, and they'll get to this. No, will they get to this? Oh yeah, they will eventually. So we're going to call this our... Let me see, what should we do? We need a library, we need training room, we need crafting, we need storage. Let's do... Hey, how did I make this? I made this too big. There we go. That's better. Okay. 5x5 five five here. One, two, three. Open it up. Torch here and here. I think this is the way, the game's way of telling us I'm moving too slowly because it says conquer an enemy tribe to increase my, my malevolence level. I think we're going to start by recruiting. Uh, let's go up here. We're not even going to bother with barracks this time. I don't think. You know what? Actually, yes. We're going to make this barracks. We're going to make this barracks to begin with. Let's throw some torches in here. And then we'll make these dedicated bedrooms later. So let's do living. Living. Basic beds. Yeah, we can get a whole bunch of folks in here for now. We don't have enough wood for the for those beds. That's fine, because we are going to be digging out some wood down here. Yeah, and in fact, let's tell our imps to grab all of this as well. Might be hitting a river again, but we'll see. Not a problem if we do. Probably don't need to do all of this way over here. Okay, the imps will grab all that for us. Actually, we're going to turn these off for now. And turn these off for now. So that we can get some of that wood in. Let them finish up these spaces. Because we need some dummies. Let's get a wooden dummy. We're going to throw down a couple of them. More than a couple, actually. And we'll also get a library, so Clarice can start training. Oh, library. There we go. Bookcase. Yeah, well, obviously we need that wood, which is not a problem. I mean, the slow start is okay. I don't believe we are at all subject to any kind of attack until we start increasing our malevolence level or gathering gold or anything like that. So slow start's okay, but we can certainly go on to very fast speed. Oh, <laughs> they dug diagonally. All right, hold on, stop that. And stop this and this and that. Thank you. Oh good, they're digging over here and we're gonna do, actually I want them to get that wood. So we're not gonna tell them to do anything yet. Oh, these guys can only dig two at a time. Okay. Okay, fine. Oh, you know what? Let's go. Just Let's just go up top and just have them harvest more trees. Okay, go get all those trees for us. Thank you so much, imps. Yeah. Oh, dig, my friends. Dig. Keep an eye on him. 
I love the sound of the digging too. It's just, I don't know, the, the, this particular sound effect is just so uh, kind of intrinsic to this game. And it's just a nice kind of, no matter what speed you're on, it's a nice kind of rhythm. What are you imps doing? Ah, we're building a library. Good. Clarice can come down here and train. Yes, and you can see that's exactly what she's doing. And we'll go up here. You all are bringing the wood. All right. Clarice has learned air blast. Well, I guess I know more than a couple of hotkeys because K is go to your keeper. Yeah, get that wood. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, oh, nice. She laughs differently, of course, because she's female. All right, now we are going to dig this stuff out. <laughs> Should be fine. And we now have almost 300 wood, a bunch of stone we can use. We're going to wait over here. Now she's doing a little physical training. Mind and body, both very important, of course. And what? We don't have traps yet, so I can't set those up. Please, you're ridiculous with your laughter. That really does make me laugh. It's so funny. Okay, so we have beds built. Uh, we have training rooms, so we can actually recruit. I'm not going to do... I don't know how to manage drunk. Aggravates enemies can see in the dark. Smelly breath. You know, but plus, plus 10 damage and defense. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, Tarot Opress told me I should see where our people spawn. Oh, okay. It's near here. Okay, the next one I'm going to be much more careful. In fact, let's... Uh, imps will cost us gold, which we don't have. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait for an artificer. No, I'm not. I can use a priest. I know I'm going to want... Oh, actually, I'm going to want a shaman. Okay, so let's do the shaman. Where do they spawn? Ah, down here. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to do something a little bit strange here. I'm going to mark... I'm going to mark this as a guard area. It's somewhere around here. And then I can put a wall there or something later. Okay, what are you? You're a wizard? Extra spell damage training potential. Okay. Okay, here we go. We acquired that wizard. Where'd they come from? Do we see them? Have they shown up yet? Did not see them spawn. Where are they? Okay, hold on. Where's our wizard? Oh, they spawned up here. Okay, they don't always spawn in the same place. Okay, all right. Good to know. So, oops, zone. Let's unzone this as guard three. And what we're going to do is we're just going to make sure they zone somewhere out here. So that's fine. I'll just be watching them and because we're going to store insane guys store. We're going to store insane guys outside when we get there. This We don't need this anymore. We know where the edge of the map is. You guys can hang out here in the leisure area. In fact, why don't we... Uh, why don't... Oops. Hey. Why don't we do a dining table? And uh, that's all we're going to do here. Are there other installations that will make them happy? We could floor this thing, but I think it's a little... Actually, we, we could throw a fountain in here. Nah. Beep. Oh, I'm not supposed to be cursing. I will bleep that. Well, I'm trying not to curse. I have a bit of a potty mouth. In general. Okay, so what do we have? We have, yes, I, need, I know I need weapons for my minions. Okay, so let's dig this. And we're going to throw the torches down here. And here. And minions are presumably 
Yes, I'm still doing that. Okay, we found another space here. But we don't have to worry on this level, really, because there's no question marks. Okay, we're going to need an artificer. Oh, we need a forge, of course. So let's... Oh, we're on slow right now. We don't want to be that. But we do want crafting. Workshop. Workshop. Artificer. Oh, let's uh, order... Orders this. Prioritize task. That. What are you? Hates all humans. No. We don't need a ton of minions yet. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we acquired that artificer. Imps are going down there. Everybody's training. We would need another bookcase if we want another wizard. Oh, we don't need to be on slow anymore. Okay, I'm feeling pretty good so far. We are going to need another, another dummy, so we might as well put them down. We know we're going to need them. And we know we're going to need the bookcases, so we might as well put those down too. And I think we will make this one of our storage rooms. And we'll open this up here. So that as things are crafted, they can be stored. So that implies that equipment storage should be here. Okay, we're going to do equipment storage on this side. And we're going to do resource storage on this side. And then we'll put a nice little... A nice little path of floor in between the two. Torches to light this place up. Very nice. And then we're going to uninstall, uh, remove construction, install this and that, and then you guys will move our stuff. Yes, perfect. Thank you, Imp. Okay, we have quite a bit of wood now, and I think we're still digging some out. No, we dug all of that wood out, so we're, we're good. So now, let's pause for a second here. Oh, what's this guy? Resistant to magic. Oh. Hmm. Well, we already have a priest. I don't want to go too crazy with the priests. Resistant to magic is a nice bonus. What's everybody doing? Let's find our keeper. Oh, everybody's hanging out up here because they're happy in their leisure room. Let's go down here. You're sleeping. That's fine. We can actually drop some floors in here. We know we're going to want floors. Eventually for this bedroom. So... We might as well just do it now. And then we'll take the beds out later, once this is no longer a barracks. What are you? Aggravates enemies. Oh, but plus 10 damage and... Okay, we're taking you. Okay. Very nice. Building our troops. Might as well just add them all to our group. Uh, except the artificer. <laughs> that would be just completely ridiculous. Okay. So, now, we're going to go down, and we're going to tell our artificer to start crafting stuff. Like, we want, uh, we want, say, five of each of these. Whoops. Ah, fine, I accidentally double-clicked there. Or clicked off of it. I like to have a few torches around. We want a few of these for our uh, spellcasters. In fact, we'll just do five of them. They're free. make a couple clubs. You, nope, I'm gonna clear you out. Okay, so are we on? No, I don't know how I put us back on normal. What are you? Remetrate Rider, plus six damage, eh. No, we're far away from having any kind of steeds. All right, everybody's gonna get equipped. Got our nice storage here. And we build. Let's see. Let's go up a level. Yeah. That's, that's okay. We might as well, since we've got the wood and we've got the imps, we might as well start preparing our rooms. You can see I like this pattern. Oh, 
don't really know why. Maybe I'll mix it up in some of the other rooms. Okay, that's all taken care of. Oh, you know what? There's stone up here. Let's tell our imps to go grab that stone. Open that up, uh, people. I need this. Very good. We'll grab that eventually. They're busy putting down floors. What are we doing here? Extra spell damage training potential. Alright, fine. Although I don't know really how much damage we're going to use our, with our priests for spells. They don't really get damage spells. At least at the lower levels. Okay, so why don't we just make a few more of these? Because they are free, and that way we're certain that everybody has what they need. We'll make a couple shields too. Actually, we should have more than a couple. <laughs> Okay, so, yes, I know we need weapons for our minions. We don't need a second shaman. <laughs> Insane. See, I'm, uh, uh, I now know how to, or at least I have an idea of how to manage these insane guys. But I'm not going to grab this one. I'm going to wait a little bit until we're a bit settled in. And I'm feeling, you know, more, a little more comfortable. Meanwhile, since our imps aren't doing all that much, let's put down some wooden bridges. That's the other thing I want to try to do uh, on this playthrough, is I want to try and be a little more proactive rather than reactive. I want to have our imps planning st or digging stuff out that I've planned. Yeah, we're going to get rid of you, get rid of you. Let me see. You're already in here. Are both of you in here? Uh, okay. Oh, we didn't have a priest. I thought we had a priest. Okay, well then that's great. Okay, more water over there. As long as we don't hit a kraken, it's fine. And if we hit a kraken, then we're dead. So that also <laughs> will be manageable in a, in a sense. And let's see if there's anything else we could build. I mean, farming. Farming. Animal fence. Um, oh, you know what we need? We need a place for a prison. Let me just... Yeah, we can't dig over here. Okay, we need a place for a prison. Let's put the prison... Let's put the prison down here. Yeah, let's do that. So, oops, oops, oops. Uh, so we'll do another 5x5. Five five. Actually, um, no. We want to make the prison bigger than that. We're going to make it 5x10. And we'll give it... Uh, Actually, yeah, no, that should be good. And then let's have just the door here. Now, the prison can be pretty expensive in terms of resource requirements to put down the tiles. But we want to get started early so we can capture folks when we go raiding because... You know, obviously we need... Uh, what, what good is it being an evil wizard if you are not torturing people? Like, duh. Okay, thank you, imps. Little torch. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. That's not what I meant. Torch. Torch. Now, we can do prison. Prison door. It would be kind of neat maybe to put down doors like a second level uh, or a second wall, if you will, of prison stuff. Prison bars, because that way we can stop breakouts. But I guess that's getting a little ahead of ourselves. So we're going to throw down beast cages so we can capture beasts. Let's do four to begin with. We don't want to go over overboard, although I am all about the overboard, I suppose. 
And then let's throw down a couple of prism tiles. Oh, they take iron. Oh, I forgot they took iron. Okay, so we can't do that yet. That's okay. Okay, extra head uh, goblin warrior that can also swim. So we're taking you. You're going to come in. You're going to get stuff. That's great. I don't care about this. Hates all humans. We've got our people training here. Let's throw you in. Okay, and so this is actually... This is actually where we're going to leave it for today. We're going to keep building out in the next episode. Thank you so much for your support. I love you very much. Please remember to have your pet spayed or neutered.